Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be teaching you guys <clears throat> how to solo a Sharko <clears throat> in Deep Vulcan. <clears throat> now, you preferably want to go a quick attacking weapon like uh, a katana or a dagger. A uh, great sword will work as well and a spear will work as well, but it's a little more slower than these. And you will need more DPS for something like a Sharko because it attacks quick as well. You also want to have a shield. You don't want to be pairing with a regular weapon. And you also want a move that can ragdoll, like Grand Javelin, Wind Gun, or any move that can ragdoll. And you also want a move that can take you into the air, like Lightning Impact, or I don't know any other move that takes you into the air, but I know that Lightning has Lightning Impact, so those who want Lightning Impact as well. And uh, Damage Buff, like uh, Static Withdraw when you upgrade it for, for another Damage Buff. You want to make sure you uh, also block the... Um, the swipes because those are parryable, but his kick is not parryable. So you want to make sure when he tries to kick you, you roll back and throw the ragdoll when um, you um, can't parry anymore or your block is um, about to be block broken. Just enjoy the clip and uh, yeah, I had to fight a shark to get out of the depths, which was actually pretty exhilarating because I did not know I could solo a shark. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. I also willingly went to the depths. I was two on two lice, and I um, willingly went to the depths. I'll tell you guys more about that in another video. So yeah, yeah. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to um, uh, comment, uh, like, and subscribe. Subscribing does go a long way. So if you can just hit that subscribe button and um, like the video and share the video to other people who may need to learn how to defeat a shark. And uh, have a nice day, guys, and see you guys in the next video.